Hi, I'm Jack Pettigo, and I'd like to show you my car collection. Come with me. Hey, I'm Jack Pettigo again, and we moved out here. We didn't have a car barn, but we had a car collection, so we built, had to build us a barn, and it's 130 feet long and 40 feet wide. It's got presently has eight cars in it now, and we have three more to bring home. The yellow car, 1958 Edsel, four door hard top. This is the left rear view of the 58 Edsel. The one I said is for sale, and as is set to where it is, I'll take $3,500 for it. We're currently working on the automatic transmission, just totally rebuilt it, and we're almost through installing. Car is for sale due to the lack of space. I got four more cars to get to bring down. I don't have the room. This is a 1966 Ford Thunderbird convertible. Got the 428 V8 engine in it, fire brake, steering, and air. And this is the car that they built. This car, like it, was one they used to build a Batmobile car. Telescoping the steering wheel and the, it, it moves like it. Makes it easy to access for anyone. Then when you put it in park, it locks it in place. Formula 458 Firebird. 400 cubic inch in, automatic transmission, hodge track rear end, fire brake, steering, and air. This is a 71 Ford. Rancher old pickup with a 400 big block in it, automatic fire steering and air. This is a 400 big block, and John Browning just rebuilt the carburetor on it. We have it finished. We've got to clean under the hood, do a front end alignment, she'll be ready for the road. Dash is all original. We uh, colored it again at Mako, and it began to fade. So. But as far as the cover itself, it's all original. This is a 70 old Cutlass 442. Positive rim, V8 engine, fire brake, steering, and air. This is a 1963 and a half mid year model Ford Galaxy 500 convertible with a big block 406 Thunderbird engine and tri power. Factory tri power. These cars are all original as from the factory, except for necessary maintenance work on them, which we do year-round. All these cars we've painted at our shop in Waco, Texas, at Mako Auto Paint and Body Works. All of them have urethane, and uh, with the exception of Red Express, it's got a base coat, clear coat in it. 
All these cars are driven every Saturday. I bring a detail man from Mako out and he'll go through and clean the shop and wash every car and vacuum every car. That's every Saturday. And then we'll take them out onto our roadway out here and, and drive them around a three mile circle. Let the engines heat up and we'll turn all the air conditioners on and make sure everything's in good shape. We hit the brakes at least 11 times. Just checking everything out, make sure they're all in good driving condition. Then we'll bring them back. If necessary, change your oil, grease them, whatever, whatever needs to be done, it's done every Saturday. I enjoy every one of them. I guess just on the road playing around will be the Firebird convertible. And uh, of course the uh, Little Red Express has a highway patrol engine and transmission. It's a lot of fun to drive too. The 442 uh, is a quick, fast car. And if you don't watch it, they get away from you if you're not used to driving a quick, fast car. The Galaxy, uh, you can drive it 10 or 110, it doesn't make a difference. It doesn't, it doesn't know the difference, it just drives that good. 1978 Dodge Little Red Express factory uh, hot rod. This truck here is a uh, factory hot rod. It came with Highway Patrol Flicker 60 engine in it and the positive track rear end, which is also Highway Patrol, automatic traffic, heavy duty automatic transmission. It has a uh, fresh realm air induction. We've changed the carburetion oil to fuel injection. That's highly fuel injected now. Red oak wood, real wood. There's no plastic on this car. It's all real wood. Okay. This is real oak wood. It's not an applique. It's not plastic like the new cars. It is real oak wood, red oak. And it was refurbished by Bill Jones, a dear friend of mine, and that had a shop in Waco. All the painting was done by Mako, all the main body in Waco. Booking seats are all original. The vinyl covering, the leather is all original. The carpet is original. The windshield is original. The stacks on the side of the truck are all thrown original. Top, the hard top actually comes off, and there's a convertible top underneath it. 312 police interceptor with a Holly full bro carburetion and uh, aluminum valve cover, chrome air intake, all factory reason. This car belongs to my wife, and if it left, I'd have to hide in the country and leave with it. I'm Jack Pettigo and I'd like to show you my car collection. Come with me.